Hi guys, this is John from Hello It's John and welcome to a new YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to prepare my ultimate chicken stock. The chicken stock is the perfect one for your Asian dishes, such as Japanese one if you do ramen, or Chinese one if you do wonton soup, or asparagus and crab soup. It's so delicious, so tasty, and it's so easy. If you don't trust me, just try it. Just try it and I guarantee you will love it. And now, let's start the recipe! For this recipe, you'll need 5 liters of water, divided into 2.5 liters and 2.5 liters 3 chicken carcasses, so chicken bones 5 chicken wings 30 grams of ginger 2 cloves of garlic 1 spring onion 1 onion 50 grams of coriander 1 tablespoon of fried garlic and 1 tablespoon of salt So first, let's prepare our ingredients Crush the garlic, so the skin can be easily taken off Cut the edge, cut it into half, and remove the germ, as the germ is difficult to digest for some people. For the ginger, to peel it, use a teaspoon and scratch it. You can take off the skin easily without any waste. Then, cut it into slices. For the spring onion, cut the bottom and cut it into half. For the onion, take off the skin and cut each side into four. Wash the coriander. Wash the chicken bones and the chicken wings. And don't forget to wash your hand with soap. And now, let's blend the chicken. Take a large pan and add 2.5 liters of water. Bring it to a boil. And then, add the chicken carcass and the chicken wings. Wait until the water boils again and then wait for 3 more minutes. When it's done, pour into a colander. Then cut the carcasses into parts. Do the same thing with the chicken wings. Wash your knife, colander, your pan, and your cutting board. Now, let's cook everything. Take the pan that you have previously cleaned and add 2.5 liters of water. Add chicken, onion, ginger, garlic, spring onion, fried garlic, salt, and of course the coriander. Cover, turn the heat to high heat and bring it to a boil. 
Now that is boiling, let it boil for 10 minutes. Then, after 10 minutes, turn the heat to a little higher than medium heat and let it simmer for at least 3 hours. The best is to wait for 4 to 5 hours. We need to reduce from 2.5 liter to 1 liter of chicken stock. Now it's done! It smells so good! You will feel that the chicken stock is still greeny, but it's okay, because we use coriander, so it's okay, don't worry. Once the chicken stock is poured into a colander, the color will be yellow. You can use the chicken stock now and serve it. It's very delicious. If you wish to keep this chicken stock for later, no problem. You can keep the chicken stock up to 4 days in the fridge or you can freeze it up to 3 months. When you freeze it, there will be a thin layer of fat on the top. Just skim it. And now, let me show you what we have after 3 days in the fridge. The chicken stock is a little jelly that is completely normal. You can see the fat or the chicken oil on the top, so let's skim it. Now that we have almost skimmed everything, we can bring it to a boil and use it. Just use the chicken stock for your favorite Asian dishes and I wish you a bon appetit! Enjoy! So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a very delicious tasty chicken stock, I guarantee you. So don't buy it anymore, do it yourself. And please, don't skip steps. You need to simmer for a minimum of 3 hours to have a perfect chicken stock. And if you like my video, don't forget to leave me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to your YouTube channel. And for my next video, I'll show you how to make a Korean soup called Samgyetang. So thanks for watching. Love you. See you. Bye.